So welcome to this class, guys. Um, we are actually going to be learning how to add, you know, customizations to our map. Okay. So the first thing you need to do is to go to mapstyle.withgoogle.com. Here we are actually going to create a map style, and when we are done with that, we will download the JSON. So the JSON file is what we're actually be using in our app to create, you know, the customization. So guys, let's click on create a style. Okay, the team we selected is standard. You can go ahead and change it to silver or retro or dark or night. Okay, so to actually ensure that everything you know shows very well, I'm gonna go ahead and use silver, all right, so that we'll see the difference. So let me zoom into my location, okay. You know, with standard, I can I can see a lot of different things. All right, you can see teaching hospital and different other things. All right, if I select silver, I might not see those things. Okay, so to add those things, you could just go over to more options, and you can go to point of interest, and the test. We can make it. Mm, let's make it shown. And change the color to something more visible. Select something red. And the icons want to make it shown as well. As you can see, it's taking effect already. All right. You can increase the weight. Can change the feel of this. Okay, so this I've just added some styles to that place. Okay, let me, okay let me choose a different color so that so guys I've just did some customizations. Okay, so this is the JSON that has been produced for us. If you want to, you know, use this style that we created, okay? Let me click on copy the JSON and close this. So, guys, we can actually go ahead, you know, and play around this, okay? There is a lot of customization. You know, on our own time, you can go ahead and play over these customizations. And when you're satisfied with what you have, you click on export. You click on finish and you copy your JSON, all right? So guys, now we've copied the JSON, we can now actually create a JSON file with it and import it to our app. So I'm going to create a test file, okay? A test file, and I'll call it map style. I'll call it silver map style, All right? So I'll now paste my JSON. And I'll click on File, Save As. I'll change this to JSON and click Save. So this is our map style. So let's go back to our Visual Studio. We need to add that particular file to our raw folder in our resources, okay? Obviously, we don't have a folder called raw, so we need to create that. Create a new folder and call it raw. It's supposed to be a small letter. So now let's import our JSON file. Is this an item? Silver map style. Okay, so now I've added it. Okay, so that's our JSON. Let's close this. So let's go to our map ready function. So on our map ready function, we're gonna say bool success equal to Google Map dot set map style bracket map map style options we need to bring a reference of this 
all right so let's resolve this grab that map style options dot load raw resource of course we're gonna say this resource dot raw dot silver map style okay that's all we need to do okay guys so that's that so let's go ahead and run an app and see the changes okay so our build is completing so our app is going to be up in the gfeed is a splash screen okay see something happened okay so let's clean our app and run it one more time so i will also suggest that we do this we'll add a try catch because sometimes you might actually something might go wrong so you don't want this to be the reason why your why your app will be crashing right so you just put in a try catch so that every other thing we continue if the map style you know didn't apply appropriately okay so let's clean our app all right so our clean is complete so let's go ahead and run it one more time bam so as you can see everything it's now silver unlike you know the usual you know standard color that we had before so guys this is just how to you know make use of map styles you know you can create awesome customizations all right so as you can see this this is the customization we made so there is no limit to how you can make your map look or feel depending on what you want to achieve depending on the colors you're using in your application and all that okay <laughs> do i like the standard color basically so guys this is just how to add map styles you know to your google map so hope you enjoy the class see you in the next one